Hello, can you see me? Hello. Yes. Oh, hold on. Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah. Okay. Cool. What up? What up? What up, guys? Can you still hear me though? Okay, good. Cause I turned on the thing. Hi. I turned off the the volume because I could hear myself over here. No, don't do that. Turn the volume back up. It's because I have my speaker attached. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's all. That can you hear me now? Uh, I'm gonna log back in. Let me uh, okay. disconnect from the thing. Okay, working out the thing. Jackie, hi Jackie. Evelyn and I miss you. Oh, I miss Evelyn too. Oh, memories. I remember when you did my hair high school prom. Oh, how long ago was that? Wait a minute. I think you look familiar. Yeah. Jackie, we have news for you. Ooh, what's the news? Oh, my goodness. Okay. I got to remember to not be distracted. Hi, guys. You guys can either see me here on Instagram under Ana Vergara Official or here on YouTube. And remember, Adam's a podcaster, so this is all new to me. <laughs> um, and he should be here, but he'll chime in. He'll chime in. So, anyways, um, also here on We Love the Mendozas. So check it out. And if you're not following over here, Instagram, follow We Love the Mendozas, okay? Go subscribe. I'll be going on more. more. <laughs> Jackie, what's the news? Evelyn's a big sis. Oh, you have a baby. Oh, you're going to have a baby boy. Congratulations. Aw. Congratulations. I remember um, actually being there, guys, for Jackie uh, when Evelyn was born. I was in the delivery room. <laughs> remember when you did Bernice's makeup in 2015 for her music video? Yes. I always remember that. And I heard, as it were. What is that? <laughs> That's me and my theme music. <laughs> you had the baby already? Send me pictures. Oh my God, I get so distracted. <laughs> okay, guys. Um, so we are live on YouTube under We Love the Mendozas. I have not been on here for over two years. And just a little bit about what we're working on. What are you listening to? Johnny Cash. Oh, okay. Hold on. You're not. Sorry. Yes, send pictures. You don't have to mess the volume on the laptop. Because what I'm doing has nothing to do with the laptop. This is shot to talk. You see that? That's what that is. Okay, sorry. I'm not a podcast. <laughs> I'm trying it. Oh my god, I am loving this piece though. Look at this. Oh my god. It's like the best purchase I've made. I actually just bought it out of instinct, you know, one of them nights. <laughs> Anyways, okay, so let's get back on track. We were talking about um, liking pictures, okay? So what do you guys think about liking pictures? Is that something like, let's say you're, well, obviously, the people that are in a relationship. Let's talk to those. Hey, Boulevard Chicanas, what's up? Nama, 63, hi. And I just want to know what people think. Because it's a topic that I saw on TikTok the other day. And um, they were talking about the single girls. You know, we're saying, oh, if my, if your man liked my picture, I feel sorry for you or something. And like, if it was bad. And then I was reading all the comments. And then I was like, you know, like, why, why is it so bad? Like, there's nothing wrong with that. But anyways, I have my, my thing. Boulevard Chicanas. Beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> It's been a while. So let me know if you guys want to chime on in. And I am accepting um, requests to be live on here on Instagram. But I'm currently also on YouTube over here under We Love the Mendozas. If you're not following, give us a follow. So anyways, Adam. What? How? I like all the thirst traps. <laughs> I like all the thirst traps. <laughs> Okay, so under the video, I put what did I put under description? Uh, liking thirst trap pictures <laughs> on social media. 
Now, for me, like back then, it wasn't a big thing because, I mean, me and Adam are like in, in our marriage, like, and even in our relationship, I've never been like the jealous type, to be honest with you. <laughs> Izzy's laughing. <laughs> I've never been the jealous type, and, and friends know, right? But then I remember back in the day, I used to have a friend actually. <laughs> she doesn't watch this. But she was that type of person that anytime that somebody liked her pictures, it was like a bad thing. And I never comprehended that. This is before I got married, right? Because I didn't see it wrong. And so obviously in my marriage, I don't see it wrong either. But then this whole thing trending on TikTok of the single girls being like, if your man liked my picture, oh, I feel sorry for you. So like, what is your take on this? I like all the thirst traps. <laughs> I like all the thirst traps. Oh my god! Okay, like cousin, hi. All the, hey, what's up, everybody? I don't know if you can see me. <laughs> I like all the thirst traps. I like all the thirst. And traps. so, like in the beginning, like in the beginning for me, I didn't think nothing of it. But then there is a rule, though. There is a rule, like in relationships, be careful because not all the girls. Sometimes girls think, "Oh, he likes my picture," you know, and then that all of a sudden they're interested in them and. I don't see the case in that. I just see you like a picture. But nowadays, like, girls make it that way. And it's like, now I feel like I have to tell Adam, like, be careful, like, what pictures you like. I don't know. It's so weird. Be honest. Be honest. You told me when I first started my social to media. To be careful, you yeah. Like, you know what? Don't be liking all these thirst trap pictures. I did tell you that. Because if you like a picture in your head, you're thinking, like, oh, nice picture. Oh, good for you. Good lighting, sweetheart. Nice lighting, sweetheart. You know, but in some people's minds, when you like the picture, that means, you know. So what else. are your guys' <laughs> thoughts? I am just like, you know, I'm trying to make this topic because I just saw it on TikTok. And um, Adam and I wanted to um, talk about view requests. Be in your live video. All right. Who is it? I know him. Zoe. Hold on. I'm trying to accept you. Okay, Zoe, uh, let me know your thoughts on this. Okay, hold on. I need hear. Can the can the music be louder? Sure. I thought I accepted you, unless it's not going through. Try again, cause I accept you. <laughs> what up? What up? What up? Hey, hey Zoe. Hey. Hey, very nice, nice to meet you. Send your hand. Hello, hello. <laughs> How are you doing? Oh, very good, very good. How's Wisconsin? Oh, it's great. It's great. It's been great. This this guy has been like my supporter since MySpace days. Oh wow. My right, MySpace. Yes. And so here's yes. the the actor has been over here. Hey, look. Ah, let me get the right hand. Nice to meet you. So what do you think about the topic we were talking about? What about it? About um, liking girls' pictures. Let's say you're, are you in a relationship? No, no. Okay. Well, let's say you are in a relationship and the girl likes guys' pictures. What, what do you think that's a appropriate would you like that or would that be a problem i'm just curious well honestly well like it's a trust thing like i mean like thinking if i mean like thinking i'm sure like i mean like thinking i'm sure it's just a friendly just 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 just, just I'm sure it's all being, being like like it's, like it's being friendly but but still I mean, if I was married, I wouldn't uh, pretend to be like it in my wife. I mean, life, life would have done that, but. Yeah, it's an iffy yeah, subject. But, so anyways, we were yeah. just here wanting to go live and talking about just a subject. That's it. <laughs> What's up, guys that are tuning in? I'm taking requests if you want to uh, join in. We are live on Instagram, but I'm also live over here on We Love the Mendoza's YouTube. 
So uh, we're just talking about topic. So make sure you follow. Are you following We Love Them and Doza, Zoe? Um, I don't. Well, personally, I well personally, um, if I as if I log on, log on to YouTube. I'm on I'm like ringing on my phone. Uh huh. I like, I like, like, I can't actually log out because that's the thing. Oh, we get it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the same way if the password isn't saved. <laughs> yeah, man. You have no idea. I haven't been on on um YouTube for over two years. Because like, we didn't have the password. Because we didn't have the password. So I had to like go look oh, for wow. it and but I'm on now. Anyways, okay. Well, it was good saying hi to you. I'm gonna go back on the topic. Hey, it was nice to meet you, Zoe. <laughs> nice to meet you, bro. Nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you. Bye. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Adios. I don't know how you exit. Or do you have to exit? Oh, there you go. Yay. I didn't know how to exit. What up, guys? Well, luckily for our YouTube, there's nobody there for my <laughs> ramblings. You guys make sure you guys follow us on YouTube. We live in Mendoza's. Uh, we were talking about liking thirst trap pictures. <laughs> okay, well, here's the thing. I think that it's uh I think it's okay to to like people's pictures. I don't really see it as a big deal, but I know that there's like a social media uh etiquette, right? It's so, crazy though. Like why? Like why does that why do girls make it into that? Because I mean the rule, you know, to make it into like where where people in relationship have a rule of like in the like why? Like well, I could care less who you like. But you know? I think it's because some people it gets to their head right it could go to their head a little bit where okay if okay because i i heard a story right it was <laughs> excuse me i heard a story where it was some it was two females and one of the females hollers at the yeah i think you should tell your man to like concentrate more on yours and his relationship because uh he's over here liking my pictures on instagram and it's like so, I mean, I think it's people like that who, like, the type of people who are, like, if, if some dude likes their picture, the type of chick that's going to call that dude's girl and be like, hey, your man is liking my stuff. I think he should focus on you more. It's <laughs> it's people like that, that that create that 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 hateful, like, you know, ambiance or that the bad energy where it's like, bro, I just liked your picture. If you... If you're trying to like it, because think about it, Instagram, you know, all that stuff, it's like a living magazine. Mm -hmm. So just like when you read a watch a channel or flip a page on a magazine, some things you like, some things you don't. Mm -hmm. So if it's especially if it's someone, you know, like, that you know, in real life, oh, you know, you know, here, here's a hey, like what's up? showing yeah. some love, showing some support. But some people have turned it into something else. And now it's so, something else. OK, so Izzy says, I'm secure in my marriage, but I wouldn't want my hubby to like single girls page. Plus Bernice would be in her dad too. <laughs> would be on her dad too. <laughs> <laughs> well, I wonder about that because here's here's what my whole thing is. Is I get the whole idea of, let's say a, uh, a dude and a, and a chick, they're in a relationship and the chick tells her dude like, hey, um, oh girl, don't put me on camera. <laughs> 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 I don't, but uh, Okay. To, to me, I just find it interesting if a chick tells her dude like, um, "Don't be liking girls' pictures on Instagram because it's just not appropriate." Mm -hmm. That's cool. I get that. But if the girl who's saying it is the same type of girl who's taking all kinds of pictures of you know sexy pictures and doing the ducky lifts and they're showing cleavage, and they <laughs> exactly and, and they don't have no problem with a bunch of single dudes liking their picture they're not like oh stop all this attention i don't want it from you single men oh it's gross like that's kind of like a double standard like if you're telling someone not to like thirst trap pictures you better not be posting no thirst trap pictures you know why <laughs> i don't mind <laughs> just kidding. i don't mind <laughs> oh <my God>. <laughs> i'm like but why oh, oh my man. god what a what a topic though um i don't know it makes you think, though, because, I mean, yeah, that's a rule. And that's a rule between us, too. Like, just be careful because not 
everybody. Well, because yeah, if know. someone likes me, like, oh my god, he's in love with me. Like it could, you know, you know how it goes. But it goes for girls too, because sometimes like I'm scared of like guys' pictures when they're alone too, because I don't want them to think like I think you're hot or something. Like that's not what I'm thinking. Like oh. sometimes I feel. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, oh, please. <laughs> I've seen you scroll. I walk up behind you sometimes Whatever. and you scroll. I'll be like, damn, all those six packs, but no beer. Hey, uh-huh. we're, we're only human, right? No, nah, <laughs> all those six packs, but no beer. Uh-huh. Oh, That's all I see God. when you're scrolling. Anyway, so let me know, guys. I know here on Instagram, <laughs> you're probably wondering why I'm looking over here. I'm on YouTube, too, under We Love the Mendoza. So make sure you guys follow We Love the Mendoza's. And we are talking about uh, liking pictures. <laughs> hey, Gio. I just saw you. Hi, how are you? And if anybody wants to come on and go live, I'm accepting if I know you. Because sometimes I, I don't, I'm scared to press <laughs> when I don't know somebody. Right, you don't want some guy to be like, hey, he hops on there with his wiener out. Mm-hmm. It's like, ah. Oh, yeah, and you, you know, and people don't do that. <laughs> You should. I show. I show him. So whatever you guys send. Yeah. <laughs> I ridicule. You should see my it. DMs, guys. <laughs> Anyways, and so that's good. Thank you, Izzy, for sh- uh, sharing about how you feel. And um, has anyone ever got in trouble for liking the wrong picture before? That's what I want to know. You tell your story. I'll tell mine. I'm just. Joking. Oh my god. <laughs> Just joking. <laughs> but honestly, like, I don't know, like, I'm not, I would never, like, I'm not insecure either. That's why, like, I enjoy having, like, I let Adam have his friends, even if they're girls, you know, when, when, um, to talk. Like, yeah, yeah, that's true. You know, because sometimes I feel like, like, I can't have certain conversations with this guy. Like, as much as I love him, he's all into politics. And you know what I mean? For me. <laughs> I'm, for not me. In, I'm not <laughs> into politics. <laughs> and um, sometimes the conversation, like, ugh, the stuff he listens to, like, I wish he would have prepared me for <laughs> Yeah, man. It'll put hair on your chest. Bro. Like, he listens to conspiracy theories and all that stuff. And, like, I'm very, like, mellow. And like when I hear certain things or put my mind to it, I start panicking because I'm like, oh my god! Like so, like when COVID hit, <laughs> I was like, he was right. Oh, <laughs> she's joking. She's joking. <laughs> he was right. Yeah. Anyways, don't say the c word. <laughs> oh no! I hope they don't ban my I know, Instagram. Dude, you can't talk about. That. Anyways, um, and so yeah, that's just basically it. Rob, are you still on? How's Vegas? Are you by the pool? Of course, you can have friends of the opposite sex. Just be respectful and know what I mean. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Agreed. And so, yeah, I mean, it's it's just both being respectful because I have my guy friends, you know, and. um, I think we had like a kind of an unfair advantage, though. Why? Because both what you do and what I do we interact with men and women and you have to be able to talk to people and be comfortable and actually create, you know, relationships and bonds with people. And so knowing that, like knowing that you were for a long time, a single woman working in the entertainment industry, like working in radio, working with different people, traveling all over the country, you know? And so it shows like, you know how to like take care of yourself already. There's a certain, you know what I mean? And so knowing that you've been, in like and you've talked to me about your difficult situations you've been in and like fishy situations where you had to like oh not going there whatever stuff like that so i know you're smart and then in my case um well i won't speak for you but i know that's that was the case for me so now i know if we're in a room even if it's a bunch of you know a bunch of handsome men dressed in suit and ties like and you have to go over and have a conversation because that's actually happened once. anyway <laughs> But what happened? What happened? Tri- well, a fellow actor, homie. I was uh, I was on set shooting uh, for a movie. Uh, this was what? Oh, uh, six- yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. Don't say the movie. Yeah, yeah. What okay, happened? Okay, so I was shooting, <laughs> and then Anna was there on set, and then one of the other actors, <clears throat> you know, uh, you know, he wasn't one of the leads, but, you know, he was one of the <laughs> actors. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't know if it was one of the leads who might have took her away. No, I'm just kidding. But uh, 
one of the act- other actors, he kind of like, I saw Anna and this other handsome dude in, in, in suit and tie, and they're over there talking about this and that, and Anna with her charming laugh. But I just kind of, <laughs> yeah, I just kind of like, you know, I just, just, I look, but I just focus on what I was doing back to my lines. But one of my actor homeboys, who's a, a little bit more of a tough guy than me, he was like, hey, so who's that son of a bitch over there talking with Anna? Should we fo- do we have to go over there or what? And I was like, it was funny because it gave me opportunity. I turned over and I said, I don't know, Anna, how are you? Do I need to come over there? Or oh something? my God. And when he's like, when I turned around and he was looking at me, he he was like legit, like, what's going on here? Why are you why did you even laugh like that? He knows my laugh. Like, why are you entertaining him though? It was funny. I'm like, bro, I was just laughing. You're making him fall in love. That was your fault. <laughs> I know how I know how oh, happens. Put your magic gosh. on me. Oh my gosh. So, anyways, and so that guy though, I literally thought I was just talking to just a fellow, you know, one of his actor friends, and he got up like this. He got up and took off, and I'm like, okay, bye. That was funny. <laughs> you scared him off. Yeah, you're a little trouble. You know how many wars in the world have started over a woman? Over a beautiful woman? Happens all the time. But I have respect for you. I never said that. I'm just saying lots of wars have been started over a beautiful woman. That's all I'm saying. All right. All right. So you all were talking on Instagram and YouTube over here. If you're not following, follow us. We love the Mendozas, but we are talking about liking pictures. So it was a topic that I ran across on TikTok and um, just Adam and I just wanted to come on here and talk about it and you'll be surprised. (laughs) What up? What up? Let me wave at you guys. Thank you guys for joining. And so, yeah, if you're in a relationship, how do you feel about that? If you're the single girl, how do you feel about that? I want to hear from the single girls. Because I don't think even when I was single, when a guy liked my picture, I didn't think he was after me. Like, I really didn't. I was like, oh, what's up? I wonder what happened to him, you know? But I guess there goes for different mentalities. I don't know. Anyways, so man, we need to get on YouTube more because I think we only had one person. Dude, what you're um the this one has more followers than my other one. We started off good. I haven't been on YouTube for two years. Yeah, it's been like off two anything. Years. And Adam was like, Woman, put your makeup on and we're gonna go live. I was like, Okay. <laughs> ay ay ay. Yeah, just so much, so much. Anyways, let's see. So, what other topic do you want to talk about? Oh, I don't know. With liking pictures. I wonder if the same thing goes for, like, video. For video? I don't know, but I know that if you watch their video, they know that you watch, you get in trouble like that. (laughs) That's a good way to get in trouble. I mostly watch videos on YouTube. Yeah, same over here. Same over here. Yeah. That is true. Looking at the who watched your video or who who watched your, it's crazy. It's like now and the thing is that like Instagram is changing like all the time. Like you can't even like forward a video now without them knowing who you forwarded to. I at least I heard that on TikTok. Not that I've tried it. <laughs> <laughs> or you can't screenshot like a message or something because the other person knows i don't know the same concept applies yeah well that's what you, everybody wants to do everybody wants to go and spy on themselves so that's, that's how it goes do you have another uh do you have different um instagrams one that you look through i did before i set up my uh my official one because you were telling me about Instagram, and then I, I set one up to um, to just oh, look. No, I'm just kidding. What? <laughs> I'm, just kidding. I'm just kidding. I haven't used it since I opened my new one. <laughs> but I remember because every now and again it sends me that old name, and it's a super cool name. It used to be one of my old tagger names. But <clears throat> <laughs> anyway, yeah. Well, I have my business ones, but yeah. Now nowadays, though, you can't even like go look anywhere because everybody gets alerted. Like the other day, the other day on my TikTok, it alerted me like who was watching my my page, and I these are people like that I haven't heard of for years. Oh, there was somebody you knew. (laughs) Okay, that could be a little. And I was like, "Why are you looking at my stuff?" But anyways, like if I know you, I know you. But if we left in bad terms, why are you looking at my stuff? (laughs) (laughs) 
Oh my god. Yeah. When will you guys that. come to Wisconsin? Ooh. I don't know. I want to go. I want to go to Waka and I want to go to Wisconsin because <laughs> I love cheese. <laughs> well, definitely now doing um, going back live and on videos and stuff. Oh, road trip, huh? Road trip. I haven't. I traveled, I think, once. Um, it was to Vegas with a couple of friends. Um, I think last year. But since then, I haven't traveled anywhere. If you guys want to chime in, guys, on Instagram, feel free. If I know you, I'll accept you. So. And anyways, I'm live on YouTube, too. You should see my little setup. Adam actually fixed it. The light is over here, the ring light. My stand over here is my phone. I have a microphone. Ooh. Wisconsin is like. <clears throat> oh, he's checking Wisconsin. Where is that? <laughs> 2,054 miles, and it's about a 30 hour drive. Let's take I 70 <laughs> East, baby. So now everybody knows where we're at. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, so if you guys have any um I don't know funny stories about liking pictures um in a relationship or if you're single and how do you feel about a married guy or a guy um Oh, here's what's messed up. What if you what happens if you like a picture but then you unlike it? Do they get notified <laughs> if you do that? Oh, so I'm in so much trouble. You I'm better so be quick. You <laughs> better be care. quick. Whatever. <laughs> well, I liked it. So what? I liked it. That's funny though, no. but like. Well, because tell me this: haven't you ever accidentally liked something as you're scrolling? It happens, and that's gonna be my excuse. Ah, whatever. <laughs> <I'm just joking>. <laughs> 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 oh my god, you're making me choke. Oh. Uh. Hi guys. <laughs> so let me know what you guys uh, feel about liking pictures. Um, but I just know that you know when I was. Uh, single and somebody used to like my picture i never thought nothing of it to be honest with you but that was me but i also had friends that i like this song that you <laughs> <laughs> i also had friends though that were like that and they're like oh my god he liked my picture but he's in a relationship oh my god i can't believe it and i would be like huh like i i just didn't understand so and or i think that's all self-important <laughs> it's only being self-important i'm not sure though i don't know a lot of words I don't know. And that's why, like, in our marriage, um, we set that rule. Like, just be careful, social media. Because, I mean, I came from the social media. I mean, I was, I was on social media since MySpace, you know. And um, and I've always been so open to my fellow followers, you know, my people, my friends, you know. And um, now that I'm married, I'm a little bit more discreet, I feel. A little bit more, like, I keep... I don't film everything like I used to, you know? Yeah, I kind of miss it. <laughs> I don't think it's because you're married. Remember, like before just, uh, before 2020, like I used to love that. We'd be walking home from the club. Yeah. Walking home from the club. Uh, get off the Uber. We'd be all lit. You'll pull out your uh, phone and do those perfect angles. And I'll be like, hey, what's up? I'll usually say something that I regret. And then in the morning, I'll be like, hey, babe, take that down. Don't don't uh, let people hear me talk shit about, what was his name? Ari Shafir. Remember, oh I was all mad at Ari God. Shafir for like, for like six months. I hated Ari Shafir for no good reason. <laughs> well, a reason. I think, I don't know, like, I think 2020 uh, messed up a lot of people, you know, period. I mean, the whole pandemic, like how um, they used to be and how they are now. Let us know, too, if it changed for you and in what way. Because I know for me, like, like I know, like, before, if you didn't know that about me, like, I was always too busy to know that I suffered through depression, you know? And that's something that I've never shared because I was always too busy. <laughs> I wouldn't let myself, like, be sad. Like, the minute I will be sad, it's like, boom, I got work for you. And those were friends that I had, you know? Okay. And then I would go travel the world, you know, working. And I never really... Um, focused on that until 2020 hit. And then you had all this time to yourself. And then it's like, bro, like all the thoughts, you know, and now it's how to deal with it. And so it's been a roller coaster. And, and I'll be honest, you know, 
but it's nothing that I'm ashamed of because I've always been open to help people out there too, you know? And it's all in the mindset, to be honest with you. I think today would have been one of those days unless until my husband was like, get your butt up and do your makeup and we're going live. <laughs> and so now I'm live with you guys. And, you know, you just got to keep busy, you know, and um, work on projects, stop overthinking things because it could get to you, you know? Um, and even like just doing the first step, going live back on, you know? Hey, DJ, what's up? And you did a great job during the pandemic. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Although sometimes it, it's hard, you know, like I kind of stood back, I took a step back a little bit, even though I'm still on radio from radio, because a lot of the times you have to entertain people, you know, and you don't want to go there sad. And it could be just personal, something just personal. Like everything sometimes could be perfectly fine in your life, but it's something within you. And so I didn't want to like give those vibes on radio. So Sometimes I would call out, but um, it's something that I'm managing, you know? <laughs> and so... Yeah, you're quite weak. <laughs> so that, that's something new about me, but um, are you still doing the... Yes, I am. Actually, I go live tomorrow. I go live tomorrow, and we have a very uh, famous pizza place that we're going to be interviewing. Your baby queen. What's up? Thank you for joining, guys. I really haven't gone live, to be honest with you, on here. And um, if you're watching here, make sure you follow and subscribe to my YouTube. I'm also here on YouTube. Um, we love the Mendozas. So, yeah. Oh, she's the friend of yours? The baby queen? Everybody's friends with you, Zoe. <laughs> Anyways, any more thoughts? <laughs> Are you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> pajarito, pajarito. Sorry. Anyways, guys, so that was that was my not everyone. <laughs> It sure seems like it, though. You know a lot of people. That means you're a friendly person. <laughs> um, what happened? Oh, is that Gracie? Oh. Sorry, I almost fell, dude. Are you okay? Yeah, right. Oh, okay. Anyways, guys, um, so if you want to come on live, I'll, I'll accept it. If I know you, one time I accepted somebody on Instagram and they were from like a different part of the world. It was so cool to see. I think they were from like Israel or something or somewhere, Egypt. Like, yeah, it was Egypt. And it was so cool to see how like how different people around the world live, you know? And so they're a really nice couple. <laughs> Anyways. So I think that's about it. Unless Adam has another topic he wants to talk about. <clears throat> no, I was thinking, well, next we're going to try to learn how to do those reviews. Because I want to review um, some movies with you. Oh, yeah. Me and Adam wanted to do uh, reviews on movies. Because we have our different interpretations of movies. Like, he'll be interesting. And I'll be, that was dumb. Like... <laughs> 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 or you know, you know what I mean. It was just an example. <laughs> or we agree sometimes on certain things. Yeah. Remember when we both didn't like a star is born when we first saw it? Oh my god, yes, I remember. We both were like, what the hell was this? Like I was so disappointed. But the second time mm -hmm. we saw it, mm -hmm. we, we fell cried. in love with cried. it. Yeah, he did. He cried. Mm -hmm. I think I did cry too at the end. But mm -hmm. uh, and then it made more sense. So stuff like that. <laughs> Anyways, well, let's log out of um, our live on YouTube. Yeah, yeah, we're good. We're let's good. log out of that, and I'm going to stay on Instagram. Okay, sounds good. How do you? Yeah, I'll help you. We'll log oh, out. and stream? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Let's say bye. Bye. No, come on. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, I meant to say. Join bye. us for the next one. Yeah, bye, sure. guys. Oh, this echoes. <laughs>